How to edit a picture using paint. Paint is a very useful tool that allows you to not only draw your own pictures and turn them into a picture file so the, you know, the students or yourself can create your own art. It's also a good tool to edit pictures, to create a, a collage of pictures, and to put text on top of pictures. So to get paint, I am going to go to the Start menu, Programs, Accessories, and then paint. So once again, I went to start, programs, accessories, and paint. You can see it opens up a paint window. Click on the second icon in the right corner. To maximize my paint screen so I can see everything. Now all I need to do is open up the picture I want to edit. So I go to File, Open, and then find the picture I want to edit. So wherever you save the picture, you need to then find where you save the picture. Click on the picture and hit Open. You can see the picture shows up right in paint. Well, let's say I want to make this a little smaller and get rid of some of the side and background, and so it's just my headshot. Now, a headshot is chest up. So I've got a little extra here on the bottom. So what I want to do is I want to cl click on the square selection tool, square with the dotted line, and then I'm going to select the part of the picture I want to keep. Because remember, for your portfolio, you want a headshot. So I found the picture, part of the picture I want to keep, and now you can see it now moved that part, part of my picture. Well, I'm going to right-click on it and hit Copy, or go to Edit and Copy, and then I need to open up a new paint file in order to paste my picture into a blank white box. So I'm going to go to File, New, and open up a new paint. I don't want to change this picture, so I'm going to hit No to save changes. Now you can see I have my blank whiteboard again. Then I go to Edit or right click and Paste. So now you can see just my headshot is now on this page. Now you have to be careful. You can see my headshot has blue dotted lines around it. As long as I don't click anywhere else, I can move that picture anywhere I'd like. I'm going to put it up in the top corner, though. The moment I click off the side, I can no longer move that picture. So you want to make sure you have the picture in the position you'd like before you click off the picture. Now, if I save this picture just as it is, I'll have all this white square in the picture also. So I want to get rid of this white square. So if you notice, there's little blue dots on the edges of the white square. They allow me, if I click and hold on them, and click and hold on the bottom one, see I get the little black arrows? It allows me to edit this white square or make it smaller. So now the only part left is my headshot. Once you've done this portion, you can save. So go to File, Save As. I like to use Save As so I know where the file goes, because right here it tells you where it's going to save the file. Save my file, and then my picture is ready to import into live text. Remember, since this is a video, you can pause and review the video at any time. Have fun editing your pictures.